Hey, Cab going with Rob. He's been uh, playing him for most of this tournament. And uh, he's been doing quite well with him. So, and he actually seems to be uh, having stage control right now. So uh, let's see if he can maintain that under SK92's pressure. Oh, good delayed up there. Oh, good, good back throw from, uh, from Kev there. Taking first stock in this match. Okay, SK92 trying to get something going with this pressure. It has enough time for a taunt and go for the edge guard. Okay, here we go with the SK92 pressure. Good attempt at that edge guard, but doesn't quite get it. Oh, that laser was good. Yeah. Okay, that, that gyro not able to protect his uh, his wall like you would like to. I'd like it to. Oh, good show grab. But SK92 with the high recovery. Good option. Oh, and then we got SK92 with the read. Oh, good power shield there. But it's going to need more than one power shield to counter these lasers. Okay, so SK92 bringing this back. Keeping center stage control. Preventing uh, Rob from getting back. But then here's Kevin saying, no, I got this. Yeah, I'm using that gyro once again to protect his recovery. Ooh, gets caught uh, charging the gyro in the air. Gets punished for that. But SK92 at high percent, so Kev could uh, bring this back to even pretty quickly. Okay, doesn't quite get that edge guard. Okay, that should do it. Oh, ask for the, the, the dare instead of the bear. But uh, still gets the stock. So, pretty even still. Good follow up from Kev. Keeping that pressure on SK92. Nice interrupt there. Ooh. Kev expecting the, the edge, edge recovery, but SK92 is slightly above the stage. Oh, uh, both getting, uh, going for the shield standoff. Both facing away from each other, so not uh, not an easy way to get out of that situation. Good up air to uh, protect discovery. Yeah, good movement from Kev all all around, but uh, SK92 able to clutch it out and uh, take the win on game one. Well, it was a really close match between uh, SK92 and Kev6669. Um, SK92, of course, hailing from Vegas, and is their top uh, PM player at this tournament. Kev6669, uh, I believe he's uh, 
I want to say they're uh, Idaho's number two ranked PM player here. Uh, Dan the Man, of course, to the left of uh, SK92 giving him support. Okay, so they're opting for a short stage. Uh, so, uh, yeah, hoping to get some early kills, I, I think. Yeah, in this matchup, honestly, it's Based on what happened last game, those, those uh, little earlier kills look a little better at starting what's needed at this point. And, then we get and here we go, the early kill right there. Yeah. Okay. Okay. As yep. down there. So there is not as good uh, because of uh, Rob's ability to meteor cancel and then end his recovery. Yeah. So. What? Oh, good tech chase we have. Not able to continue going with it though. But get something going right now. Yeah, gets a couple, of, gets a grab into a tilt, into an up air, to, into a kill. Nice. SK92 a little too low to grab that ledge. SK really keeps on that, uh, the laser pressure. Just getting those little bits of damage in there. Maybe even cause a little bit of interrupt without those lasers for it. Have that little bit of extra knockback causing that. Oh, so, those shields yeah. are looking really low. Oh! Oh, gets the tr nice trade from SK92 with it there. Yeah, that was a very good trade. Yeah, that gyro is a lot more menacing on this small stage. Yeah, small stage, a small stage, and for the most part, very flat stage, which makes the gyro even more menacing. Uh, with, with that gyro, platforms make it a little easier to get around it, but it's but with PM, the gyro is just such a useful tool. Good jab block from SK92, forcing pressure on a shield. on the ledge waiting for his moment to get back up while yep. the laser just going overhead. Alright. Rob of course being very heavy so that's not gonna kill him. Oh once again SK92 with the trades. Those trades are working out for him. SK uh Kev Trying to finish off this stock and bring it back to even. SK shield getting pretty low there. Uh, Kev's going a little bit more aggro right now. Trying to get that kill. Hopefully he doesn't get too much damage and get punished for that behavior though. Okay, here we go. 68%. Yep. Bit of a danger zone, but a little careful play. It's possible to come back to this. Both of them can get easy gifts on each other. Yeah. Oh. Uh, no. Okay. Cat's still living. Now throw. Good re grab. Yep. Oh. Good shield on against that shine, though. Yep. DI back. But SK gets the shine this time and falls up and up here for All right, SK92 takes game two. Have they started a uh, melee? Um, yes, melee dubs has started. Uh, we have closed the rack the sign up for singles and hopefully we are getting that put together very fast here all right run to sky world interesting choice yeah i might give uh, the ability to rob or to circle stall around uh Falco's pressure. Right. Yeah, it doesn't seem like he's doing really
really great here. Starting to be able to get that percentage in, but SK is just kind of controlling the match at this point. Get a nice, uh, fairly quick stock without too much damage on him. Oh, missed laser. A little bit of punish from. Yeah, Kept playing a little uh, less safe right now. Yeah. SK-92's pressure is on point, so... Yeah. Kev doesn't seem like he's quite playing oh, well here. Oh, that Good recovery. Uh, nice thing about uh, Rob is his ability to use his recovery move a few times before it dies out. It allows this stage to be okay for his recoveries. But SK just not giving up the pressure here at all. Oh, and there it is. Yeah, you don't really see uh, Rob taking full advantage of that top platform. Yeah, no. Okay, Kalanoki, next Smash Jam will be J uh, July 11th. The weekend right before EVO. Uh, all outs have everyone come on out for that, get a little bit practicing right before. Oh, oh SK92 clubbing there. Yeah. And uh, that might be the break that Kev needs to uh, take this game right now. Oh, yeah. Sometimes it's little mistakes like that that turn things around completely. But SK92 is not going to give up uh, control of this match without a fight. Good forward smash. Oh, missing that up air. TV11, Green Tag, against JPEG Sandra. Rob able to recover. Throws away the gyro. Yeah, not taking very uh, good advantage of the gyro this match. Alright, Kevin needs a gimp right here. Yeah. Oh, that's should be punished. Not too much of a punch out of that, unfortunately. Oh, good back here. Alright. Kevin, bring this back again. But, good big grab. Yep, that's big grab. Oh. Oh, my God. Oh! Fucking go, Oh, my God. The brawl power is real here. Alright, now he's got grabs of his own. Three. Good DI out of that, and then a tech roll to just... Uh, just out of the space to get that, that tech roll. Yeah. Uh -oh. Oh, good grab from SK. Good choice. Kev just landed right into that grab. Oh, this could be it. Oh, back air. Missed the laser. Oh, oh the good gyro. gyro. Forward smash, and that is yep. it. Very good option there with the gyro to just gimp the give yeah. up the recovery, and then just a good, solid uh, follow up there. Yep, so Kev uh, stays in this, taking game three. But SK92, of course, gets the counter pick right now. Are we going to see a 3-0 comeback from Kev stream? Let's see it happen, guys. SK can just decide on his stage choice here. Oh, 
Oh, the character oh. switch. Yep, opting to switch over to DDD. Three, two, one, go! Good ball, Dash. Oh, a portal very early on. It tries to read the... Or be on stage. Good job, Derek. Knock him into the air, get in the back air off him, and then just grab the ledge, make, keep it a nice, simple, safe uh, kill. SK now trying to kind of find that rhythm. Uh, it, DD is a different rhythm from uh, Rob by far. Alright, Kevin's done with that electric. Model B, I guess. Oh, he's got another one. But it just walked up there. DD, though. Loady but heavy, so even some moves that you expect to kill actually doesn't. Oh, gets interrupted by the electric model B. SK92 is still able to take the stock. combo here. Good use of some pillaring tactics as well as uh, tilts to just keep moving with DDD and not letting him escape. Yep. DDD is such a big target. This combo crew. Yep. SK though did misread the tech roll and as such uh, didn't allow DDD to escape from it. But he's starting to find that spot again to just kind of go back in. It. Oh, misses oh. that uh... That shield grab. Yep. SK is just barely moving back to avoid the shield grab and following a forward smash. Bring this entire match really right back to his favor. Ooh. Miss base that. Uh, yeah. There we go. Reaction from Kemp Kev, perhaps? But SK92 sure. still gives it to him, so. Yeah. I almost wonder if Kev was actually waiting for SK. Once he get back, got back on stage, he realized he got back to stage and decided, I'm gonna wait a moment and see what he does. And. SK92, yeah. trying, or, or Kev, sorry, trying to take advantage of DDD Super Armor. But that doesn't face SK92. Kev trying to use advantage of the platform a little further out to get the Waddle out there. Or Waddle, well, Waddle dashing as well as a ping on the throw. Decided to go for the loop. Or smash. A Gordo does allow him to get back on stage, but. Good pressure from SK. But the oh, oh, he gets the game. But still, stage quite high line. percent. Yeah. We are talking DDD though, even though he's got a very big hitbox, he does have the potential to win this. Yeah, he does have some gifts on the spaces. Uh, SK doing a good job not actually really approaching DDD too much. Um, at this point, one of bit best option more or less is to attempt to, almost attempt to suicide it, which is much of a difference. SK just like, no, I'm not going to let SK92 you do that. SK92 not that. giving him any chances. Yeah. As long as SK92 doesn't make any mistakes, then uh, he should have this match. Gordo versus Laser, or Waddle Dee versus Laser. Kev was almost. Well, that's almost close yeah. to the platform. Yeah. Kev was kind of just sitting there daring SK to come out. Oh. Okay, get back here. Yep. And SK92 takes it, 3-1, going on to Grand Finals. Alright. 